Okay, you guys, I'm out of breath. I just ran up the stairs. Jonas is coming home from work and some really exciting news. So this morning I took a pregnancy test and it said that, it said that I was pregnant. So I'm gonna take another one and I was like shaking and I wanted to video it this morning, but it just like, it didn't seem real. I was like, is this real? Like this better not be messing with me. So I'm gonna take another one and then I'm gonna surprise Jonas when he gets home. But you guys, if this is like legit, I was like literally shaking this morning, but like I wanted to cry, but I couldn't because I just still don't wanna get my hopes up because I'm only taking one pregnancy test, but I'm gonna take another one right now and then I'll let you guys know what happens. You guys, I just took another test and it says I'm pregnant. You guys, I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant. I can't even talk right now, you guys. I'm like not even sad because I'm just so excited. I can't believe this is happening. You guys, I am pregnant. I'm gonna go surprise Jonas right now. You guys, this is insane. Literally six months of trying two positive pregnancy tests. Okay, I'm like shaking right now so bad. Okay, I'm gonna go surprise Jonas. It's probably gonna be really cheesy, but like I just can't wait because this is like so exciting. Okay, you guys, Jonas is coming inside the house. He just got home from work. Let's see if we can keep the camera from not being noticed because I couldn't really find anywhere to make it work really good. So, here we go. Box to put it in, so I just put it in a box. Are <laughs> right, you some mail? Also, that fell. I got you a present. These are my shoes. I know, I got you a present. I put it in the box. Well, what happened to my shoes? I put them, I just put them in the room. two tests today? Yes. And Why'd you take two today? Well, to see if it was real. Well, doesn't, I don't know if two in the same day does anything. Well, I'll, I'm going to go buy more tests tomorrow and take some tomorrow, but. <laughs> see, you were stressing so much about it. I know. <laughs> That's pretty scary. <laughs> How did this fall off? I don't know, I was with Mello today and it fell off. It's a cat. <laughs> it's a cat. Mello's getting a baby. <gasps> Are you serious? <laughs> this isn't an April Fool's joke. <laughs>
guess what? Also, who's <laughs> opened his eyes? I'm pregnant. No, you're not. I'm pregnant. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm pregnant. Michaela. No, yeah, you're not. No, I know. I found out like two days after the Salt Lake meet. No, you're not. I'm pregnant. Oh, Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding. I have to Scott. <laughs> Scotty. What? Michaela's pregnant. What? Okay, let's print it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Oh, I like your jacket. Hey Alexa, guess what? What? I'm pregnant. <gasps> no way! Yeah. No way! Yeah, Stop wait. it! No way! <laughs> Are you serious? I'm okay. serious. <laughs> no, you're dying. No, really? You're kidding me? No. Really? Are you serious? I'm serious. What What's up guys? I just thought I would document how I'm feeling because yesterday um, I flew from Salt Lake, I'm in Virginia for my last gymnastics competition and I have been like not feeling good and I know a lot of pregnant women probably get a lot more sick so like I hate complaining but the last like five days, nothing has tasted good to me. I have no appetite. I feel like I can like barely eat and I feel nauseous. I feel nauseous all day, but like haven't thrown up, which is like really annoying because I'm like, even if I went to the toilet, I don't know if it would come out. And then I don't know if I just want to like sit there by the toilet because I hate that feeling. So... It's been kind of rough and it's really hard because I'm seven weeks pregnant now. Um, haven't gone to the doctor yet, but my first doctor's appointment is in like another week. So I have this weekend and then I have a whole week and then my doctor's appointment. So actually like basically two weeks and or a week and a half, but haven't gone to the doctor yet. But as of today, I'm seven weeks from my last missed period so anyway it has been I'm just really tired my brain hasn't worked I've had a crazy <laughs> adventure just getting here and stuff that's happened to me last night and this morning so anyway just thought I'd pop on here and give a little update so when we make this YouTube video um I can look back and remember what I did and kind of how I was feeling and it is hard because I'm by myself like Jonas isn't with me my mom was maybe gonna come but she ended up not coming just because it was so last minute and then she's really sick right now with like a cold so probably best that she didn't come because I'm like seriously so exhausted and I would not want to get sick from her but anyway nobody is here to take care of me and the first day we have a banquet for the competition so it's not till later tonight and I just like don't want to go anywhere I like don't know where to go get food because nothing tastes good to me so I'm just like really struggling I'm like man how do people do this because I'm struggling and this morning I went and got I went down because they have breakfast here but then I'm like I don't want to pay like 15 bucks for breakfast if all I eat is like a piece of toast or like yogurt or oatmeal and so anyway they're like oh the Starbucks is open right there but it's not a full Starbucks so I'm like do you guys have oatmeal and they ended up just giving me the breakfast oatmeal because there was so much left anyway and they're probably just gonna throw it away so I was able to get some oatmeal and I just still do not feel that good it did not really sit right in my stomach because normally for breakfast, I can barely eat toast. Anyway, this is going to be a fun weekend. And it is so hard not going on social media and being like, Hey guys, what works? What doesn't work? How do I get through this? Um, but I just can't wait to tell you all, you guys. This has been such a ride. And I am so blessed. Like Jonas asked me the other day, he's like, Would you rather not feel sick at all and not be pregnant or would you rather feel sick and be pregnant and the mom was like 
I don't know because I was like this is just not fun because I could like barely pack and I was in the shower and literally I'd do anything to feel this way to be pregnant so super 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 lucky super happy but it does suck not feeling the best and it is hard because I'll ask my mom questions and she's like I don't remember I was pregnant so long ago and then so many things have changed and then same with my sister like she's been able to be helpful but it's still been hard because her youngest is eight now and still so many things have changed since then so anyway it's gonna be a journey but a really fun journey and I can't wait for you guys to be a part of it and for us to document this journey it's gonna be so fun anyway so sad I can't tell you guys yet but the news will be out soon and I'm just trying to survive the day and hopefully I get through the weekend with all my sessions we have four sessions in three days so each day there's three days of competition they all have four sessions and usually I'm used to taking a nap maybe two a day and we'll just see how this goes but this was also why I've kind of been MIA on social media so when you guys go back and wonder why I haven't posted anything and haven't really posted much on my stories it's because I have not felt good or have cared to even do anything so anyway can't wait for you guys to be on this journey with me and yeah so just had to document my day but that is how it was going okay guys we are at prime iv and kayla's getting oh and kayla's <laughs> getting her ivs done you guys so this is tacy my hair girl I'm and she's seriously part. the sweetest and the best so, so i'm not going to explain all right now because i'll probably catch it in another video um to put for you guys but i've been really sick and tomorrow i'm actually going to take my announcement picture so that's really exciting but i've been throwing up a ton i've lost 11 pounds it's been miserable and two days ago i had an episode where i threw up probably like 10 or more times like every 30 minutes to an hour went back to the doctor and I'm just giving me a shot in my butt and my nurse has been wanting me to get an IV but then I've been so sick to leave the house and they were telling me at the doctor's office that I wasn't dehydrated enough even though my pee was like really orange and it's like really orange right now it's <laughs> disgusting so Tacey was like we got to go to this place where I get IVs so she came with me even though she's not getting anything today so what a trooper she's the best so sweet and I'm getting my first IV so hopefully this will help me feel better but this yes. is awesome so good we have massage <laughs> also, chairs Tacey's pregnant too you guys so right. at least I have someone to go through with all this Tacey was really sick too you guys at one point yes. so he saved me it's it's good to have a friend to go through this yep. one so heck well, yeah I'll catch you guys okay bye okay you guys secrets yeah. out secrets out well I've already recorded some other stuff but oh. we are here at our OB's office at the clinic here and we are gonna go get our first ultrasound and hear the heartbeat of our baby because I am pregnant and of course I'm not gonna explain it all right now either but you know I've been really really sick so I'll have to talk about that more but it's been a long it's been a long couple of weeks, weeks so 12 the reason, weeks yeah 12 weeks the reason I haven't been on social media is because I've seriously been so sick and it's been really, really, really bad. So I'm gonna tell the doctor everything today. I've called my nurse a couple times, um, gotten some medicine and different things, but I'm gonna tell the OB today and I got an IV yesterday, but I'm feeling okay today. I think the IV really pumped me up last night cause I was up late talking to <laughs> our photographer cause she's staying at our house and we're doing pictures after this mm -hmm. for the announcement. So. We're so excited. We can't believe this is happening. Even though I've been so sick and it's been so hard, we are so blessed to be able to be having a baby. And today is like a really big special day. So we're really excited. I hope Jonas is excited for it. I'm excited. Okay. If you're watching this, this is our first real YouTube video in a, in a long, long time. Yeah, like, like, I mean, that's not a podcast. We're going to do a podcast about this where we'll just spend a long time just talking about the last 12 weeks and what we're expecting. Um, but yeah, this will be our real YouTube video. And we'll gonna... see, we'll see officially though, how far along I am. So I'm 12 weeks, yeah, but so we'll see. 12 weeks, but we feel like she might be more than 12 weeks. 
so no no bump yet really because I've lost 11 pounds so fun stuff all right well we'll catch you guys on the inside we're so excited we're so excited for you guys to be a part of this journey I seriously can't wait I cannot believe that I'm pregnant and that all this hard work has finally paid off <laughs> I feel like I'm trying and being exhausted and just trying to get pregnant is just a really hard and tough time so we can't wait to share our journey with you guys and what we've been going through and we're just so excited we're getting our ultrasound we're gonna get little pictures mm -hmm. of baby junior so anyway we'll see you guys on the inside see ya it's exciting okay we do it again at the bed okay i'm gonna take this i'm just gonna tuck this okay. in here and tuck that into your pants there and then just a little bit low Oops, i just broke it that's totally fine do I need to scoot it down a little more? Is that okay? Okay, let's have a look at the baby. All right. There's the baby right there. That's so cute. It's the heartbeat right there. Mm-hmm. Say so it's weak way cooler seeing it on this than that little Size check. Go from the top of the head down to the tailbone. Let's go right here. Way down to there. And you're measuring 12 weeks even. So you're going to keep your dates right where you are. Perfect. Perfect. Cool. Okay, now Is we there any way we can proof. get just a couple extra pictures? Because oh, yeah. we're going to do a photo shoot today. Yeah. To announce it, just to have some extras in case we need them for the. Yeah, let's do it. Let's finish lunch. Oh, of each profile. Cute. You have two little arms right there. So like there's one forearm kind of hand by the face. And the other one's a hand by the face. Let's see if we can get a better view for you though. Oh, legs there. That's so weird. That that's inside me. I know, right? It's kind of real. Get a better view for it if I can. I might just have this kind of side view. It's so cute. That's your baby. That is crazy. Look at that. See ribs on the side. Oh my gosh. Right here, you kind of start to see those hands by the face. Oh, the it's hands. so cute. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, it looks real good. I'm just waiting for the day that starts flipping. Yep, <laughs> exactly right. <laughs> that's awesome. We'll print your lunch, but we're seeing it the head right here. Uh -huh. Body here, you can kind of see limbs coming off. The arms here, heart beating away right there. Oh, whoa, that's weird. Is that weird? The heartbeat, whoa, that's so cool. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, at least I know it's alive. It's good. And the baby that's really good, little legs down here, you can oh, see the umbilical oh, cord. Look at oh, that's so cool. There's another little hand right here. That Some is elbow. so cute. Yeah, well, things look awesome, no concerns. So cute. Not getting a great profile of you, just position the baby, but things all look really good. Congratulations. Yay. That's cool. <laughs> okay, guys, we're back in the car. We're back. Look what we got. Woo! 
and I'm 12 weeks exactly. Look, look, look how cute. cute little guy. It actually, when, I don't even know if we mentioned this, but this is technically not our first ultrasound because my sister is in med school and she has like a little ultrasound thing. And so she's done a few. If I still remember how to use Final Cut, I'll put them up here as <laughs> yeah. we're talking about it. But yeah. But, but those actually... It, but it was like hard because it's on a little iPad and it's not... So the quality wasn't as good? Yeah, and it looks really tiny. Like when you see but, this, it's like bigger. But the little guy was in a better position to like see profile and stuff. Yeah. So we have both, yeah. which is cool. Super cool. But then we got to hear the heartbeat and see the heartbeat. Like there's a I didn't know it was so fast. He was like, it was so fast. And the doctor was like, oh, 150. Yeah, that's... I was right like, where Whoa. it should be. I was like, well, that's crazy. He's like, yeah. doo -doo. okay, 150. I'm like, yeah. whoa. But. And you're 12 weeks exactly. 12 weeks exactly. So crazy. I just can't believe that thing's in me. Like it. It's I feel weird. like we're calling it that thing. Because I don't know what to call it. Little guy. Little baby. I think it's a boy. Jonas thinks it's it a boy. It looks like a boy. Tell me that doesn't look like a boy, everybody. <laughs> I mean, I want boy and girls one day i want at least some of each so whatever i get i'm excited for obviously i feel like girls there's just so many cute things you can buy but like i'm i'm kind of like voting team boy in a way like for some reason like i've always wanted a girl first but now i'm kind of feeling like i want a boy it's so weird but i'll be happy with whatever i get but mm -hmm. baby is so cute baby harmer yep it's so cute. Okay, well. So now we're going to get ready and we're doing a photo shoot. We're gonna go do a photo shoot so that we can announce Baby Harmer to the world. So mm -hmm. anyway, we will, maybe we should, we could get some behind the scenes of that to throw yeah, in here. Yeah, we'll do that. We can do that maybe. Okay, well, we'll see you guys later and we're so excited. I can't believe I actually have pictures. Can hang them up on our fridge, which will be so cute. Oh, so we can see cute. his growth in different stages my next appointment 16 weeks i don't know if they do ultrasound pictures every time i'm not sure how that works because i'm so new to this but we'll get to see him grow so we're so excited oh, sound like that. <laughs> no i stole your phone how's it looking you look, look gorgeous fabulous? you're not even gonna feel pregnant after this Imagine being God's favorite. You guys are so nice. Genuinely. <laughs> I felt so ugly. So ugly. <laughs> he has to get BTS on YouTube. That's right. Say hi, everybody. <laughs> BTS on YouTube. Hold that right there. This is that. The silhouette of that looks so pretty. You actually look very pregnant because it's rounded. Mm -hmm. But, okay, face me straight on for a second. Yep, and hold this right here, like down low. Yep, right there. And then you're going to close your eyes and keep on looking around towards the outside. For just a sec. And then we're going to get details. Can we just do a little practice kind of? Practice throw? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you're going to throw it. You're, then... I'm not going to throw it in the practice, though. No. You want to pick this up? Yeah, we're going to like throw, throw, get out of it. So throw, throw. Throw. And then... So okay. like, and then when you're dipped, just hold it until you hear the confetti stop. Okay. Falling. You ready? Don't worry, you don't give multiple shots of this. So, ready? Okay, ready. Set, go for it. Oh my god, that looks so. Set, go for it. Chuck it. Oh, you literally. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, yeah, guys, get it. Doing real good. Just standing here watching. Each little piece. The one time it's nice about being pregnant is you don't have to do anything. <laughs> All right, everybody, and that's a wrap. We did it! <laughs> so that's a wrap. We took you with us to the doctor and then got a little behind the scenes in our photo shoot. And now we're kind of just waiting to get those pictures back. We just finished recording the podcast um, where we talked about our whole experience. Finding out Michaela's pregnant. Also, what? Funny fact: we just were talking in the podcast about how I've been doing so much better, and I got the IV and all these things because it's really been a rough pregnancy, and I went through it. 
Yeah, so when, when you <laughs> when you watch the podcast, we're all positive. We're like, this is great. Michaela's not sick anymore. And she went and threw up afterwards. But anyways, so go check out the podcast if you want to hear the whole story about the last 12 weeks. And let's go ahead in the future. Yeah, I'll tell you all the details there because if I start talking too much, I think I'm going to make myself sick again. So <laughs> can't do that. But Yeah, but I hope this was fun. Thanks for coming along with us, and we'll try and do more of these. So let the journey begin. Yep. See ya. Mm -hmm.